Hey YouTube, Dagger to Friends and Pals here with another Datacrons guide, this time on Bell Savis. Uh, before we begin, I'd like to warn you about the fifth Datacron. It requires four Rakata Energy Cubes, which are a rare, rare, rare spawn around the entire planet you can find while leveling or while you're finding these Datacrons. I have looked about 20-ish hours, I have not found a single one. There are known spots from beta, the coordinate system from beta to now is different, but haven't found a single one, and I know where a few spawn, and even then I can't find any. So I wish you the best of luck for that, but do note that that's going to be the hardest Datacron in all of your Datacron hunting. The first Datacron is plus four willpower and is located northwest of the Imperial Command Post in the high security section. You can follow the path northwest to the T intersection, then turn to the southeast. You should see a few giant roots around you. Head to the one closest to the rocks, then head southeast to the cave hole shown. Head into the cave, then follow the path to the end to receive your Datacron. The second Datacron is plus four endurance and is also in the high security section, in an area called the Lost Cave. To get there, hop down from the first Datacron location and head north along the dotted paths. Alternatively, you can run east from the frontline camp in the maximum security area and follow the paths east and north from there. You should find yourself in a snowy area with rock walls. Head north along the western edge of the rocks until you can climb up and behind them. Then head south and down the incline. At the end, you should see the cave. Enter it and be ready to fight some level 42 elites and champions. They do above average damage for their level, and several pulls have adds that come out of nowhere. A trick is to kill the main one, then run away, forcing the adds to despawn. The champion is fairly straightforward. Kill it and use your Datacron. The third one is plus four presence and is located in the northern area of the maximum security section. Follow the zigzaggy path through the zone from frontline camp or nut up and beeline for the coordinate shown. Either way, you'll start in this little snowy area next to the mountain. Run up the snowy path and turn right. As soon as you make the turn, there will be a cave entrance on your right. If you see a turret, you've gone too far. Turn around and head into the hole. From this point, just follow the wall on your right all the way around until you see the Datacron. The fourth Datacron is plus four aim and is located way out in the tomb area in a lava pool at the coordinates below. To get there, head east along the path from the Imperial remote post. This Datacron is supposed to involve a nearly invisible bridge, but is currently bugged, allowing you to fall through. So instead, we're going to run around to the northwest and jump on the rocks surrounding the pool. We want to go clockwise around the lava pool until we're south of the Datacron. When you get to the spot shown, you'll have to carefully line up with the edge and either mount or use one of those 150% speed cooldowns and jump to the edge below. If you made the jump, congratulations! If not, you can use the stuck command to try again, or suicide and run back. When you're ready to leave, you can use the transporter to the west. The fifth Datacron is a green matrix shard and is unbelievably hard to get. It is located just northeast of the fourth Datacron in an area creatively named Cave Under Tree. To get there, head to the coordinates shown. It will appear you are under a bridge on the map. Head northeast through the little canyon type thing and watch your left side. There will be an elevator you can ride down. Directly in front of you at the end of this large room, there is a machine. This machine has four terminals, each of which requires a Rakatan energy cube, as mentioned earlier in the video. You do not need to have all of them, a friend can bring some as well. When each of the four Matrix power consoles has an energy cube, the primary console to the far right side can be used. The cube in front of the consoles will become a Datacron that all in the area can access. Well YouTube, this is Dagger to Friend of Pals. If you liked the video, please hit like. If you'd like to see more, please hit subscribe. And if you'd like to see more or less of something, please tell us in the comments below. And if you happen to be on the Fat Man server and you get four Rakata and Energy Cubes, uh, give me a whisper, because I probably still need it. Anyways, have an outstanding day, and thanks for fapping with us.